thing about heat is that it impacts everybody. There are some people who are more vulnerable to the heat based on their exposure, their personal health. Um, some of the things that we like to emphasize is those who are young as well as elderly and those with uh, medical conditions. Um, pregnant women are at some of the highest risk because of their body's limited ability to regulate their body temperature. Um, but it's not just people who feel the impacts of heat. There's also pets and livestock. So we got to make sure that they stay cool and hydrated. And actually infrastructure can be impacted, especially for a long duration heat wave where you can have buckling roads, buckling walkways. So it's important to know um, and stay aware of how hot it is and how hot it's going to get. As with any weather event, you need to make sure that you have a plan. And the same goes for extreme heat. Make sure that you have uh, a place to go to get air conditioning and get that cooling relief, um, or make sure that your air conditioning is in working order at your own house. Then it's important to stay hydrated because that's how we keep our bodies cool, through our sweat. And as we sweat, we need to replenish the water that we're sweating. The other thing is if you have scheduled outdoor activities, try to reschedule them for cooler parts of the day or cancel them all together and reschedule them for a cooler day down the road. So hydrate, um, stay in, in the shade in order to keep cool or go to an air conditioned place and just slow down. Make sure that you are not doing any rigorous uh, physical activity outdoors, you take breaks, and again, hydrate above all else. It's really important to keep your pets uh, in the shade, keep them hydrated. If you can keep them indoors where there's air conditioning or take them to a place where they can go inside in air conditioning, that's even better because they only have the ability to pant in order to uh, relieve the heat from their bodies. And another thing that people may not think about, pavement. The pavement gets really hot, so you have to be uh, careful about where they're walking and how hot the temperatures of the pavement that they're walking is. Make sure that you check in on your friends, family, and neighbors, uh, especially those who are elderly and don't have the ability to regulate their body temperatures as well. Um, and those with small children too. And if you go anywhere, remember, don't leave anyone, be it a, a, a child, uh, elderly, other dependent, or a pet in a car uh, for any duration of time.